Yowza, yowza, yowza. Well, here we are on the 8th day of January, and how are your resolutions going? I only had the one that I try to do every year, but it usually bites me in the ass. That's where I try not to get ultra pissed off at inanimate objects that don't do things that I want them to. That's pretty much my big goal for the year. We'll see how that works out. Heading in for the big election season. Oh, yes, and everybody's still going, Trump, uh, how can he? Oh, by I'll tell you why Trump is so important and why he speaks for so many people. So many people believed, oh, yes, they believed in their elected representatives, and every time they turn around, the elected representatives sent their jobs overseas. So they no longer trust them at all. They don't trust anyone in Washington. And Trump says all the things that they believe, that the game is rigged, and he knows it's rigged, and they can't buy him. On the Democratic side, of course, they have Hillary Clinton, and they've actually stacked the deck so that she will be the nominee. And she shouldn't be. They should find someone without all the baggage, somebody who speaks sense, somebody, wait, speaking sense, that's not going to happen, not if they're going to end up in Washington, that's for damn sure. The affluenza kid took off from Mexico. He's finally been uh, captured. His mom is brought back to the States, and she has a million-dollar bond, and her lawyers say that's just not right, really. In my world, she would be executed for aiding a felon, the felon son who killed four people, and the lawyer got him off with 10 years of probation because he had affluenza. He killed four people because he was driving drunk. How stupid do you have to be? I mean, does affluenza really affect the brain that much? And the lawyer who came up with it, phew, you want to know what's wrong with the country? That's what's wrong with the country. Making excuses for people doing evil things. Like why aren't the bankers, the bankers that caused the big recession, depression we had a few years ago, why didn't any of them go to jail? Not a one. Let's make this our year, the year of the people. Let us get together and start talking to each other. Gun folks, non-gun folks, talk to each other. There's a way to figure this out. That's what America has always done, figure this out. But we've stopped doing it for about the last 50 years. We've let lobbyists buy our Senators, our, our congressmen, lobbyists buy everything and they change the laws to suit themselves and to line their pockets. And they are going to come after our Social Security eventually. You know it. I know it. Carlin talked about it years ago. We need to organize now, this year. It's an election year. We need to throw the vermin out and make every effort to try and eliminate all the rules that allow vermin to flourish. That's what I think our new year should be, the elimination of vermin. And we will get to it right now, because it's Friday. Oh, yes, a long-awaited Friday after, after the whole Holiday situation, coming back into the workplace to deal with the lizard pig dog boss and the stupid rules that they have. And, oh, it's time for our meeting to discuss your future and what kind of raise you're going to get. And you know you're going to get the high hard one. That's just the way it is. But we do have two days. Sometimes we have only one. So enjoy it while you can. Anytime you can get out of the war, enjoy it. Get some sleep. Have some drinks. Party with your friends because this weekend is here, the first full 
weekend, a real weekend of 2016. And we need to start thinking, start drinking, and having uh, some fun. Pigging out, porking out, freaking out for this first weekend is here. It's official and you giata, 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 gotta 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 g